Welcome back, YouTubers. We're going to take a look at the schematic and see if we run the DRC, check for errors, and let's reduce them to zero. So let's do that today. Let's jump in. So we got our schematic, and I believe we didn't do a ERC last time. Uh, the DRC is right here. E RC the electrical rule checkers welcome back youtubers welcome back let's see so what we getting here as far as arrows go uh let's run it and see so here's a schematic let's run the perform electrical rules check let's run it and see what we get we get do we get what we expecting to get? Zero? Are we on zero? We got 24 errors. Okay, we have 24 errors. And we need to do something about it. So let's look at what we did last time. Okay, so we got 24 errors. And now we got to reduce to zero. So let's look at it and gonna take some time patience and reading <laughs> global label ground and see error what's going on here let's see ad584 Okay, I will say let's start with the no connects. Let's reduce some. Let's reduce some warnings. Warnings. It says. Has simplify. Has been modified library import symbol. Okay, we did that warning error. Wires not connected to anything. Okay. So let's take our let's take care of that one. Yeah, we have one here not connected to anything. Delete. Let's run it again and see where we are here now. Okay, let's see. Run. Oh, we are 23. Thing not connected. Okay, so those we can fix with this symbol right here. They're not connect. And I think our grid is. Probably 25, they look like they use 25 for those symbols. They usually in uh, Kaika, they recommend to have those at 50 when you do symbols. So every everybody gets in the same page. So now let's save that and let's keep looking at electrical rules check. How far do we get? 19. Are we making progress or what? <laughs> okay, so it looks like we are making progress. So let's see our. Or do we have time for more? Yes, we do. Let's run it again. Okay, those not connects. Let's solve with the with this symbol here. Okay, so we are on twenty five. Drop, drop, drop. There and there, and we should get less now. Save it do the ERC 
run we are on 13 now okay making progress it says error error label not connected to anything really okay so if it's not connected to anything let's get rid of it okay take that one out delete 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 save it drc how are we doing are we doing good or what all right we got 11 now so pin not connected okay we got some more here so for those we know what to do we take this little flag here drop one there one here one there save it run it all right we're down to eight very good let's see that's a warning let's check the errors first it says error input power pin not driven by any output power pins and this one too that's in 28 and 31 okay 28 and 31 so I think for that one we need a get the power flag here flag search for flag and I think if we do that rotate I think it will go away let's see that's for boss save it and let's run it run we down to seven okay we are down to seven okay it says pin not connected okay and so let's run and see let's see what how far how far do we get here it's not connected let's put that symbol there save it and that's something there too let's see not connected save it let's save let's do another erc let's see run erc we're down to six we're down to six okay and let's see pin not connected origin and not connected i don't know exactly what this is doing here but let's get rid of it delete save it run it yes we are going down to five all right let's see now here input power pin not driven by any output power pins okay i think we need another flag there so let's do a power flag put that in there rotate rotate um, i'm gonna put somewhere there and we're gonna connect from there to there and let's see if that clears up run we are down to four so 
we got 11 warnings. Let's take care of the errors. It says input power pin not driven by any other pin. Okay, so, so we need a flag there. Let's get another power flag. Okay, let's that. There. Let's save it. Let's run it again and see what we get now. We're getting three error. That input power not driven by any other output. That's that one. So I think we need another power flag there. Let's put it there. And let's see how many we get now. Save ERC. Run ERC. We're getting two. All right, last one. It says input power pin not driven by any other output pins. Okay, I think we need another power flag here. Let's put it there. Wire. Save it and run it. No, that's not the one. This one. Run ERC. We down to one. Excellent. Okay. All right, so now let's, let's find out the last one. Error, let's look, warning, warning, error. Let's do this one. Setting one, okay, close. Let's put another power flag there. And save it and let's do it. All right, we're down to zero. The other ones are warnings. We can live with warnings. Okay, so so that's it. That's what we're gonna do for today. Uh, we finished doing the ERC here. Let's save it and let's go back to update PCB from schematic. And let's see how we're doing there. We got zero arrows, zero warnings, close. So we are making progress on both sides, the schematic side and the layout side. So we still got to move things around here. But all I want to do today was the ERC and the schematic editor and we have accomplished that we went from 21 to zero arrows ladies and gentlemen we did good <laughs> i think we did good zero very good all right, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.